Let's go to Scotland. Yeah, let's go to Scotland. Good morning. Good morning. We are on our way to Scotland. Yeah. To Braemar, to the Scottish Highlands. And we're two hours, ten minutes into our trip. Yeah, it will be a six hour drive. Yes. And we're here at T Bay Service Station. And because the service station is so nice, we thought we would stop and buy something for tonight. Yeah, and have a tea. Yes. And this is like right next to the Yorkshire Dales. Yeah, so let's it's, go inside. Yeah, because it's a lovely station. It is. It's a bit rainy, but that's totally fine. So let's go inside. Yeah. This is for you. Look, they have Scotch eggs. Yeah. Fancy that? No. No? But yeah, like said, let's just sit down for a couple of minutes. Because I wanted to have some cake. So what's that? Carrot cake. That's carrot cake, yeah. And well, this is porridge. Uh, ah, look, I <laughs> I need to sit like this, <laughs> like a hunchback. Um, well, tea bay service station, you need to improve. Yeah, no gluten-free stuff. No. And we must say, Gloucester service station in the Cotswolds is amazing. They do have gluten-free things, but here it's just, you feel like, I don't know. An outcast. Yeah, exactly. But let's continue with our journey. And it's very windy outside. This is what the weather forecast said. But, but Scotland, we're coming. Yes, yeah, Scotland. Here we go. Next stop, Scotland. I can't help it. I need the toilet because of all the tea. But um, I spotted a sausage roll stand, a little car. Did you see it, Jörg? Yeah, but it was closed. Was it closed? And you know what? What's really funny, there is, like, did you see the gate as well? Like yep. a, a castle gate here. Maybe we can film it. Sausage rolls, but Jörg has enough for tonight. Oh, see? Gone baking, back soon. Jörg, Jörg. Let's check out something else first. Very fitting for a Scottish service station. Yeah. This is perfect. Do you know when you realize you're in Scotland? Yes. Yeah, when you can buy Haggis crisps. <laughs> exactly. So this service station looks very nice yeah, as well. Yeah. Has a farm shop, but no gluten-free things. I believe when we travel back to, to, to Cheshire, no, we're going to stop there. So we stopped here in Curris, near Fife, and it's supposed to be such a lovely 17th century village, but we will try to find some shelter and tell you more about it.
the reason why we picked Chorus is, first of all, it's stunning, and we should mention the pronunciation. It's not Chorus. No. You don't pronounce the L. No, it's it's pronounced Chorus. Yeah. So, always so good to double check. And it's a very popular filming location as well. So many of you, us included, watched um, A Castle for Christmas yeah. with Brooke Schultz. So part of it were filmed here. And also Outlander. Of course, Outlander. And yet is a huge Avengers fan. So Captain America, the first Avenger, part of it were filmed here. I think we should re-watch it. And we, we booked a table for lunch at the Red Lion Inn. A very traditional Scottish pub. This is such a lovely view. And what you see in front of us is Chorus Palace, which is a late 16th, early 17th century merchant's house. This is our spot for lunch, the Red Lion Inn. This is Steak and Haggis Steak and Haggis Pie, pie yes. And this is a gluten free. Yeah, I forgot um, a gluten-free uh, smoked sausage and curry sauce. Curry sauce. Yeah. Enjoy. That was nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Just really good. We we couldn't film because it was very busy. So we booked a table. In case you want to come here yourself, make sure to book. Yeah. You need to do that. It's just a small village, but the pub was so busy. And while Jörg and I were eating, we overheard the pub owner talking to some other guests. And he said there was a location scout seeing him today, asking whether they could film some scenes for the next season of Outlander. Yeah. And he just said, uh, yeah, you can do that. Yeah, but how much is it? <laughs> yeah, it depends on how much you pay. I think this village is beautiful. Yeah, what do it's you very think? special. It's so special. It's so different to all the other places we've, we've seen before.
looks amazing. Oh, it's very nice. And on our list is <laughs> another destination. No, another village. Sorry, I'm confused. And then we can go to our final destination. Sorry yeah. about that, yeah, but come on. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Before you get blown away. <laughs> We're now in Falkland. We are, and it's another Outlander filming location. And we picked it because it looks so picturesque and is about 30 minutes from Copperus. Yeah, and it is very famous because of this palace. And the palace is from the 16th century. Yeah, Renaissance. I think it looks very nice. It's closed now, but should you head this way, I think it's really worth checking yeah. out. It's got the oldest royal tennis court. Your first impression, Jörg? Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Cozy. <laughs> That's true. This is the high street. And as you can see, it's very small. This is a vintage shop, it seems. <laughs> I love the hat. <laughs> and look at this. I love this dress especially. Such a small place and such a lovely shop. It's cold. I'm so looking forward to our hotel now. And a nice cup of tea. We are finally in Brema and we will be staying at an amazing hotel. A really amazing one. Yeah, it's been on our wish list for quite some time and we will share all about it in the next video. So, I think it will be lovely and amazing. Stay tuned for that. Yeah. And until next time, see you soon. Yeah, take care. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>